Am I psyching you guys out with an earlier start time? Earlier being two minutes late still. <laughs> Welcome to the channel, everyone. My name's Twice, and this is not Midnight Suns. Uh, yeah, that seems good. Scary random events will not spawn. Wouldn't want that. Alright. But it is Dredge. A game that I know a couple of viewers have been clamoring for. And, uh... A friend bought it for me recently. Thought it'd be a nice, uh... Winter... Counterpart to Dave the Diver, which we played over the summertime. And was also a delightful fishing journey. Let's get into it. Hey, pirate. Heard good things about this? Well, that makes two of us. Don't it? Job listing. Angler wanted. Hey, Ben, pirate. Does it not match up with your last game and love of octopi? <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of tentacles in there. I'm sure it's fine. Morning light fills your eyes and you're trying to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. And the man notices you. Welcome to Greater Morrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. So you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Oh well, I'm glad to see your new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Alright. I uh, don't know. Okay, so we've got... We've got an inventory system. Uh, like... The Resident Evil style, which I love dearly. Pursuits. Catch fish. Okay. I guess there's a DLC, too. Cool. I guess let's undock. Yes, yes, good, good. Rotate camera, yes, yes. Uh-huh, yeah, that's fine. I must fish. Disturb water, stock high. Okay, fish. Uh-huh, yes, I understand. I've caught a blue mackerel, yes. Oh, and you gotta, you gotta stop, stop, put the fish in. Okay, okay, okay. Lots of blue macro, understood. Yep, yep, sure, sure. Mm -hmm. We really like the blue macro here. Really like the blue macro. Okay, depleted. So, it only... Wait a second. That looks like identical to this. Time. I'm sure it's fine. Only when we're moving does time pass. Which is a weird way... To put it, but it reminds me of Super Hot. <laughs> Where time only... Passes. Ooh, cod. Can I rotate the cod? I totally can. Nice. <gasps> what have I done? Okay. 
Time only events is when you're moving, fishing, or taking other specific actions. Uh, out of curiosity, uh, when does when does the fog roll in? Get a lot of I need the second act of Baldur's Gate. Yay! Yay! It's lovely to hear. How you doing, Pat? More blue mackerel. Uh, maybe we'll still go for like a new. I want to visit this village, but I'm also afraid that I won't it won't count and I'll be I'll be in big big trouble. But now I, I gotta just gotta see. Just gotta see. Claws fisherman, you have for somewhere to sell your fish. Greener Morrow's on the west side of the bay. Keep an eye on the lighthouse and wouldn't want to lose sight of it for too long. Andrew brightly lit show. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other marbles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello, is that... Uh, no, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you have in head. You got anything nice with you for today, perhaps? Only if you really like fish. Alright, I might be screwed on my very first day, which is very exciting. Uh, I just really wanted to see what that was. Lights help you see, but make you more visible. That's good. Make your presence known. Oh, cool. They lessen the the panic. Great. I'm not. I'm not pan. Well, uh, it's fine. It's all good. This is a normal fishing game in a normal fishing village, and we are normal fisher people. You step onto the dock at Greater Mara. The mayor's waiting nearby. So you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you get off the town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you the replacement vessel. Yours, though. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so I'll consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt's repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, sell fish to the local market, which will pay off your debt, and turn keeping the population fed and satisfied, understand? Uh, where do I sell the fish? I was kind of hoping for a, why am I becoming an indentured servant, but uh, it's fine. A local fisherman will praise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours. Sell those fish while well, they're still fresh. You enter the squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. Familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. He's a new fisherman, eh? I'm surprised they found a new one so fast. Uh, what happened to the other one? He... Takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, okay, got it. Uh, turn into a fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more, too. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but... We still got debt outstanding here. I suggest you work on paying it off first. Let's see what you got. Practically worthless. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Do I just F F F F F F F F F F F We did it. Oh, there's a hold F button. Okay, well live and learn. Mayor's standing outside the fishmonger's store. Excellent work. No doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you could make something out of it. Why don't you take it? A research part. Could be used to develop new equipment, but would need investigation at a dock first. Okay, let's put that down there. 
One last thing, our local shipwright mentioned. She might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Okie dokes. Um, but what does the research do exactly? You can research new rods. Extra fishing speed. Volcanic shallow. Coastal shallow. Coastal shallow mangrove volcanic mangroves. Or speed. Extra speed. Pots, nets. Uh, let's just get the fishing speed up. That is going well, I guess. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hole. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Can you guys hear when I get achievements or no? I figure not, because I assume it's like a steam thing rather than that. Oh, you can. Huh. You just can't see it. Understood. Not a big deal either way. I was just wondering. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payments up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take on any damage from the rocks, or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hole she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just remember, bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install, so plan ahead. Oh, does researching just mean I can buy it? Ah. I understand. Catch for the shallows, but limited reeling speed. What do we got here? Got it. We can just install it as such. You've got like a range in lumens, which is pretty great. It's the first game we've heard on, though. To be fair, we've been playing Midnight Suns for the last month, and that game is loud. Yeah, two hours is fine. I know I just wasted all my money on that, but it's it's uh it's good. It's all good. I don't like the wake up because that means we can we can go hunting at night and that is uh a little terrifying. Let's just not worry about it. Just gonna go fish in this very Nice, easy air. What's that? Floating boot. Okay. It is what we thought it was. Disturbed water, but it's shallows. We don't have the equipment for the shallows. What a shame. It's also shallow. Do we have any coastal? Looks like a, a wreck or something. Ooh, dredge. Music on. Is this. Blah, 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 I can't talk. The music is nice on this. Real dramatic. Yeah. So far, so good. Oh, it literally. It just shows you what it's gonna be. I get it. I 
if you catch it a little later in the day. I'm really good at the atmospheric water noises, huh? If you catch it later in the day, it's more likely to be fresh. Understood. I actually, through absolutely no No preparation or thought on my own. We're only two minutes late today. I know. I'm just as surprised. Oh wait, squids! Arrow squid. Of fog and other things increase your panic, bright lights, and sleeping will reduce it. Okay. I don't know how to measure panic. Even though I've played an amnesia game. Does that mean I was basically early? That's what I'm I'm saying, but Work's still pretty nonsensical. Just always new nonsense. And it snowed like Four or five inches around here? Let's talk about the order. They asked for a gold flounder and a gray eel. Yeah, I don't know what those are. Have to have a rod that handles shallow water. Should break and sort that out. Yeah, that's fair. Sell all. Yankty. Seven dollars remaining of debt. Let's get uh, a shallow rod, shall, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> Hunched woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Why are you here? Uh, I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the lane. The mayor's got something to say. Just the person I was hoping to see. We'd be sailing out east towards Little Morrow. Would you please give this package to the dock worker there, please? Uh, yeah, sure thing. Boss. Mayor hands you a small damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. Dock worker will pay upon delivery. Please be quick. I don't want it to spoil. Please check your compass, and it's straight ahead, Mayor. I might be brain damaged, but I'm not, like, that brain damaged. Even me. I'd like two or three inches, quick snowball, it's all clear now. Yeah, I was happy. Eh. Let's just do this now. <laughs> Maybe we go for coastal stuff. Or, sorry, shallow stuff. Um, a little more here. But yeah, just a uh, quick bit of exercise, and it stayed clear. It's the most satisfying thing when you shovel and there's the snow stops, because then it's like... Uh, the weather god said, that's a pretty good shovel job, twice. No more shoveling for you today. Darn toot. can see my entire driveway. Brings a tear to my eye. Delivery. There's a small hole in paper. Peeks inside. Can't say for sure. Feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. This will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He has you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it doesn't make much sense to me. I'll surely get more use 
out of it. Sustainable fishing. Ooh, the pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat any time. I know how lonely it can be. Okay. I assume both of you are shallows. Yes. Oh. Yikes. Stingray. Oh, wow. Stingray is beefcake of a... of a fish. Do you count as shallows? No, you're, you're dredge. Judge dredge. Thanks, I'll be here all week. It's Jim when you have snow. It definitely lets me pretend that uh, for a while. Especially during the winter gulf flounder. Is that what you wanted? I can't remember. Oh, yellow is auto, huh? All right. Oh no, it's trophy. That only manages to confuse me more. I'll be real with you. Mm. Big old sharktopus. No. No. Over here. No, that's dredge. Okay. All right. All right. Fair enough. Then. Keep your secrets. I think I just heard the cat do something stupid. Okay, maybe I'm gonna, I might, I might go check. <laughs> see if the cat killed herself or something. Or knocked everything over. We got her a new cat tree recently, so she's been feeling rambunctious, to say the least. Chelsea just got home, so like she's immediately gonna leave. But this has been your your kitty cat appearance. She ran out of the room uh, that I found her in. I think she knocked over just some stuff on a shelf. Because we got new shelves and a new cat tree, so she's been uh, exploring her altitude, <laughs> for lack of a better word. Um, all whiskers intact, hasn't made the same mistake with fire. No candle issues. She did jump onto our fake fireplace, which is not hot. It's fake. Uh, and knocked everything because it's super slippery knocked everything over plant candle that wasn't lit a number of other books and then she just kind of looked at us she didn't even like slink away sheepishly she was happy she looked proud of the destruction she had wrought isn't that right my little fluffster Okay. 
Oh. Oh. I'm bad at this. Okay. I think this might. Ooh, that's my bad. It might be both things they wanted. I'm not totally sure. Your nan's cat can't change, take change at all meltdown if you even move a sofa or a candle. It's kind of incredible. She's not like that. She just delights in causing trouble. It's it's different. What can we say? What was the pursuit again? One flounder, one eel. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got that for sure. Yep, yeah, sure did. Uh, boop. The trophy, I assume, costs more. So we'll keep that there. She got assessed by the vet, and they were like, she has some kind of genuine mental condition. Oh. Alright, another order. A couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night, and you know what nights are like around here. Good luck. 2256. I feel like I shouldn't sell the trophy, but it's gonna just be bad otherwise. Debt adjusted, that should be it of it, right? That should be paid. Mayor's walking quickly towards you. Seems to be in a good mood with a spring in his step. That is hilarious. <laughs> like we don't we can't understand that not either. I get this one. She's just uh got an appetite for destruction, you know. Just call her slash. <sighs> Thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Marrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. Old Dry Dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger's services. He might have something to talk about to you soon. It's good work. I'm glad you've chosen to be here with us. Dry Dock. Dry Dock can make significant improvements to your vessel here. Talk an extra space, more attachment points for equipment, or even superior holes. A decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. How do I get those? Well, there's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get at them. Materials assigned toward upgrades here will be stored, so don't worry if you only have half of what we need. Two rod spaces. Four net spaces. Two engine spaces. Uh, we don't have any nets, so I want to do that. line is just a better shallow, right? This one is oceanic, but we can't can't do that. I feel like I want to buy this. Yeah. Uh, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna just sell that. That's better shallows, yeah. And the shallows seem to be more uh, expensive, anyways. So, sustainable fishing.
That's a lot of different types of fish. Oh, there's aberrations. Weird. Oh, just six out of 174, huh? All right. No big deal. Fourteen-year-old cat's pretty impressive. My record cat is twenty-one or twenty-two. I couldn't tell you. Milo was a tough old some bitch. Let me—that's all I know. Barn cat and all. I did love that kitty though. Let's see what's over here. We gotta explore while we can, you know. Blackstone Isle has a workshop. Workshop looks as though it hasn't been used in decades. Yeah, let's go inside. It's locked. Alright, good good start, good start. The store is also locked. Okay. Uh goodbye. I uh never exploring again. I I I get the message. <laughs> Sorry to have uh disturbed. I assume this would be oceanic, right? Yeah. Makes sense. That's more dredge that I can't dredge. Can we go out at night for a bit? Why not, you know? What's the worst that could happen? I don't think anything, to be honest. Although I do have some highly inefficient uh, inventory management right now. You're just a gosh darn flounder, aren't you? Alright, for now, for now you're in. For now. Nan's oldest was Tansy at 25. I feel like cats living longer than dogs is similar to how uh, girls live longer than guys. And it's just... They're so dumb. <laughs> okay, got a squid. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Good, good squid. Good. Uh, discarding you because you're bad. And then I'm gonna. Try some things.
just I just don't think it's happening. So that that's pretty nice. is almost immediate. That's cool. They put her down because she kept forgetting where she was and let out guttural screams when she was lost. Don't blame me. Any fish for that order? Sure do. I got a couple squids. Light groupers are in the shallows, huh? If you say so. Look out back. Useful. Rods, reels, rigs. Fishmonger reaches under the counter. Hands you a damp batter book. A few shimmering fish scales are stuck to the cover. Thought it was your eyes for a second. I don't blame you there either, to be honest. Okay, we're reading. That's fine. Uh, I don't have anything to do. Let's just snooze. The astigmatism. It's back! That's more of a light thing, though, isn't it? It's fine. Nope. I kind of want to just fish you out. It seems like you've been there. for a while. Cyclopean flounder. Ooh. Sprawling jellied mass spills from a single eye socket. What appears to be a dark pupil is in fact the center of an egg. Gross. Give me more. Oh, it's regular. Boo! <laughs> Get out of here, regular fish. Unless the black flounder is just like a... Is that another variant? Also kind of... That looks different. That is different. That's not a buoy. That's a message in a bottle. Someone call the police. 21st of August, 1927. arranging out a little bit more. Got finished a book. 10% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Okay, let's read that now. And also let's read this message. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of Greater Morrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere. Shallows at the back of Greater Morrow. Struck the front of the boat, did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around a few items fell overboard in the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern. 
We believe all important articles are accounted for. We've been checking over some notes from the vote for main renaming ceremony. Paranoid, you performed the steps incorrectly. I've never known them to be so superstitious. Back of Greater Morrow, huh? Don't know if I should do that today. Um, but I kind of wanna. No, oh, this is before. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of Greater Morrow. Love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know he'll keep his hands on the wheel instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly, as you want ill fortune to follow the vessel. I wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's Riches was a good name. I think he prepared a surprise picnic. Uh-oh. Lunch. I can see the basket half ridden, stuffed under a blanket out the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. Mm. We'll do that tomorrow. I'm a big, big baby. It's abandoned. Why are there lights on? Oh wait, this looks like the flounder I could use. Grouper. That's uh, that's the word. Yeah. Cool. Oh no, my blue mackerel got lost overboard. All right, I'm gonna be a lot more careful all of a sudden because I didn't realize we could immediately lose so much. Fishmonger, sure do. Kachunk. Didn't they get it? Yeah. Night fishing is a tall order. I'm meaning to talk to you about a new business venture I've been considering. <gasps> Crab pots. I've got one here for you, in fact. It's a bit banged up, but I could get it fixed at the ship, right? Okay. Sure. Oh, and like... It... Take, it puts a hole in your hole that you can't remove, which messes with your inventory. Should be pretty straightforward. Drop it out to sea anywhere. Come back after a day or two to check on it. Got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species can be found around here. You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Ah, oh, no. This is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. I wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish, as though feeling for something. Pushes from one side of its stomach, and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open. From his stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing, and I'll pay you for the fish, too. Of course. Not the first corrupted fish I've seen around these parts, so I'm sure you'll find more before too long. Pay you well to find any more. Interesting. Well, let's sell the fish, I suppose. Man's looking at you through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear, I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it. Not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out to Spay and cut south. I have a business proposition you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Alright, terrifying. Thank you. 
Yep, boat, please repair my boat. And my crab pot, thank you. Uh, that leaves us with 300 and something, which is not enough for the hydraulic rod. Okay, uh, in that case. I don't. I don't know how to get this material, because I don't know how to dredge. So I guess I just snooze. Fisherman, if you're into a photographer on your travels, she docked here a few days ago for supplies. I suggested she take some pictures of the town for promotional purposes, but she didn't seem too interested. She meant she was heading south. Perhaps you should introduce yourself. Select the crown pot ability with E, deploy one of that, catch things over time, but they need repairing every so often. Okay, I'm just gonna put it right here. Easy peasy. And then I'm gonna head south, which is what I assume to be here. Oh. Disturb one. Can we get struck by lightning? That is so cool. Um, let's go here first. I know we were going to go around the back of Blackstone, but... Look. Or, back of Greater Morrow, but... I'm hoping this is where the guy is. Ooh, looks promising. The man is standing in a doorway watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. Better than being bound in skin, I guess. You came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things. Art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. I give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. Carried items of great importance. As you can imagine, retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel and equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. Find me these lost relics and I reward you in ways beyond all imagining. You need, not giving up. you need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? Sounds great to me. An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music block, and a key. Those are so specific. If this wasn't a video game, it would be impossible to find. I encourage you to ask around town about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Uh, workshop, are you... Nope. Okie dokes. Thought you might be where the photographer is. Oops. I... I'm already ruining my driving habits. Fishing habits? Whatever. Who wants to give me some aberrations? You're not an aberration, but I'll put you here for now anyways. Story progression pace seems about perfect. Yeah, you can't... Uh... There's a, always a fine balance you have to do between... Uh... Like, keeping your audience interested. Nice. But not overwhelmed, right? Uh, there's no way we have the boat to get back there right now. Let's just uh, curl around this island. Stone hums quietly, sending ripples everywhere around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface. Vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. 
It sucks the stone. It does not respond to my touch. <sighs> Too real. That looks dredgeable. Start dredging. Press F to... Ah, got it. I understand. I, I get what you're... I'm picking up what you're putting down now. Well, look at that. It's a worn gold ring. Oh, you can't... Oh, they do that so well. You can barely see the rocks. Even the rocks reject your moment of tenderness. Oof. It's true, though. Uh, check the pot. Common crap. Thank you. Link. Okay, you can bump into those because they're guarded with tires. I understand. Got any crabs for that order? Sure do. Sure do, boss. Regular business. Sell it all. Could buy more crab pots. But also, why would I do that? Uh, the builder is different, right? Not the shipbuilder. You approach a, mo a woman sitting on the dockside staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? It's peaceful. It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I just got to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? We should always keep moving forward, moving along. I can't go back. She's gazing out to sea again, lost in thought. Say, so find me some materials. Maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber, two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You're welcome to visit, too. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Hmm. My housekeeper, uh, who lives on Blackstone. I see a lot from up here, you know. I saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. I watched an unnatural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. All right. Strange happenings? I've seen plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. She holds the lantern up so it shines brightly onto your face, Alan Wake style. Are you really standing there in front of me, or is this just another of the fog's tricks? Okay. A spot near the back grader tomorrow. Yeah, I was actually going to go there tomorrow. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rise up from the patch of dark water. Mm. Cool. I didn't repair my boat. It's fine. It's fine. NVD. How's our uh, how's our book reading going? Ninety percent complete. That's pretty good. Oh, there's a shiny thing right there. It's fine. Lighthouse towers above. Waves crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken. Throw its feet. You ponder the intrinsic power of the structure. A vast column of stone, shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until it decays into ruin? Its purpose exhausted. The lighthouse towers above. Neat. Haunting. That looks dredgeable. Dredge me. research part. That's fine. Metal scraps. Okay, cool. I'm just happy we can do what the game's named after. No playing lies of P without any lying. Or any P. Nah. 
also. Ooh, that looks evil. I'm in. A slab of rock juts from the water, bearing crude symbols of curved fish. At its base, a rough shape has been chiseled away. Do I have to fit... Uh, one, two, three, four, five cod in here? Because if so, neat as hell. Alright. Blood sacrifice of fish. I'm all in on it, honestly. Doesn't bother me none. Here, no cod. I assume that's where the uh, shipwreck is. All that's left of this boat is an old husk. But if we look inside, we find a research part, a ring, and an old iron chain. Hmm. Heckin' cool as hell, honestly. Now I want to see what's here. Looks like eels, though, right? Yeah. I kind of am waiting around for nighttime because they said it would glow. So I'm going to probably look around for some oh, cod. More stone that hums quietly. Place it. It doesn't respond to my touch. Big, like, you are maidenless vibes from Elden Ring. Cuts deep. I see something sparkling there as well. A pile of loose debris. Clearing this would take some strong explosives. Hmm. Okay. Do you have storage back in town? I do. Yep. There is something there. Don't know why it's doing this, but we'll uh, we'll see. Oh. We can definitely make this work, right? Okay. So we do just place that there for now. Yeah, I know it'll be lost. Calm down. Uh, do something fish there boom okay so at night you can tell if it's um aberrant I suppose bring it inside there Ooh. Sorry. Is that a boat? And another boat? Ooh, intriguing. Oh, I don't. Oh. I'm feeling a little panicky. I did not see anything that would uh, count. We can fit right through there. Easy peasy. Life is good. Not worried at all. I was worried a little. Any crabs? I think you needed a second one. You did not need a second one. Sell all the fish. Go to storage. Oh, my storage. Plunkus. 
Plunkus. Though I, I do think the Dry Dock... Yeah, just throw whatever you have here. What do you need? Lumber, bolt of cloth, bolt of cloth. Extra rods, more engine spaces. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Uh, more of the engines. Oh, nice. Got a book. Alright, what book did we get? Oh, we can't check that right now. I think I want to buy the hydraulic rod, but I also don't want to... We'll just, you know, we'll store it. Okay, I cannot store it. Wait, yes I can. I cannot. To storage, yes I can. Okay, bought it for storage. Repair that. Maybe a better light? Cloudy lens, cracked bulb. It's late at night, but uh, I think we'll be okay. We've got our cabin. Rods will reel and fish 10% more efficiently. Cool. A spine broken with sharp angles and crooked curves. A row of teeth bent on revenge. Ooh. What's the other one I got? Shard ray. Stone skin of this ray is molded around a black crystal shard. Ooh. Map. I don't know what the X markers mean. Uh, I'm intrigued. Gale Cliffs, Devil Spine, Twisted Strands, Stellar Basin. Search Relics, Two Lumber, Two Scrap. Blah, 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 blah. Yep, I'm good. I want to go to the. Um, So it's easier, way easier to get aberrants. Host eel. like it's for lumber only, but we need lumber for future things, so we're fine. Doesn't bother me at all. Could also go for like five cod. Are you cod? Alright, I could always check, couldn't I? Oh, that is hard to deal with though. Oh, you are cod. Okay. Not enough though. Currently. The question is will it count? Will I need fresh? What's the dealio? Is everything okay? <laughs> We know about strange occurrences. I don't get out a lot anymore, so I don't see much of what goes on. I do you remember the old mayor in his final days? What an awful sight it was. Screaming and throwing things into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry over and over, begging anyone who would listen, howling it to the wind. These days I almost feel like I understand. My only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold, dark water. Man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. 
was wondering. I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. Or a bronze belt buckle, especially engraved. Recognize it anywhere. There's a chance you could find it. I'd be in your debt. Okay. Uh, painter? Uh, fisherman. Thought you stopped by. Welcome to my humble studio. If you're wanting to experiment with some decorations, yes. I'm the person to talk to. Hmm. Flags, bunting, to add some style to your boat. I have a design here already that you might like. Find any others on your travels, bring them back to me, and I can rig them up for you. Of course, I can also add a Spanish color to your hull. I'm sorry to say my selection of pigments is limited at the moment, though. Could I help hmm. find more pigments? He thinks for a short while. Well, the other day down by the shoreline, I saw a strange crab with a most strikingly vibrant coloration. And these aren't suited to clambering over rocks and chasing crustaceans, you see, but if you caught such a creature... Clear scraps of cloth and paper from his workbench, revealing a large pestle and mortar. The right binding agent, we can grind them together for a new mixture. He turns back to you. A cunning plan formed in his mind. Fisherman, bring me some of those strange crabs. We'll turn your vessel into a work of art. But for now, what can I help you with today? Uh, deliver flag. Uh, hmm. Hunting hmm. on. Done there. Trader. Got anything special lately? Uh, this worn gold. Wait. Not that one. You needed the ring. I don't remember what I didn't need, actually. So I'm gonna hold on to this stuff. Question is, can I fit? Three concurrent spots, and I feel like the answer is no. Nah, I just can't do it. We gotta go back. Got too much good stuff. Oh, but now there's cod. I think the cod's about to dip, too. Well, actually, no, cod did dip. That's fine. Fiddler crab. One second. Uh, don't overcommit yourself when the sun starts going down. Better come back with a small catch than to not come back at all. Uh, okay. In this case... Numerous glowing shapes flicker and squirm behind a distended rib cage. Oh, great. Oh, that's cool. It's very cool. Uh, going back out. Ooh, give me the fiddler crap. Perfecto. Uh, let me pick up the crab pot as well. Back to the fishmonger, got the crabs. Boom. I have some use out of the old pot. You can always buy more here or repair damaged ones at the shipyard. I have one final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats the flesh of one of those mutants? Uh, I bet they go mad. <laughs> well, perhaps. 
But I want to know for sure. You're just gonna you're gonna eat the mutant fish, huh? Alright, okay. No, that's great. That's good stuff. Very uh very very excited excited and uh, happy for you. Two scrap I mean that's engines. Early, early night tonight. said stock low but oh come on oh wait no we still get another one i mean i'm really excited to see you deviantly sharp teeth with chunks of smaller fish great now that map I assume, I assume it's uh, marking off spots we can dredge, but... Fishmonger... Fish... Wait, one second... Uh... Uh, yes. A wave washes over the fish, sweeping them away. When the water recedes, you notice something is lodged against the rock. Sinew spindle? Aberration bonus. Handline reel wrapped in a length of stretchy... Sinew, one end is grafted to a crude bone hook. Uh, I don't have the space, so we're gonna put it in storage. Is M for map good? Yes. We got a fish to give um, that absolutely crazy person. So that's that's good. Yeah, touch the rock. Rock doesn't like you touching him. Blah blah blah. What we got here. Oh, that looks promising. Oh, you can even see the shipwreck below. That's super cool. I feel like I'm playing Thumper or something. Ornate key. You're telling me, boss. That's a relic. The rest aren't. Got it. Understood. Normally large and heavy key cast from an unfamiliar metal. The teeth of the key are curved and sway before your eyes like tendrils. Great. 
Um, let's just go around the back of this one, because we have it before. What did the, uh, right, what did the... No, not you. Not you. Here. 5% more movement speed. That's not terrible. Oh, I see the shipwreck over there. However, I am terrified uh, to even try. That looks like more eels. I think we can fit this in. Yeah? Yeah, for sure. I didn't see anything else on that island. Tusked grouper. Just kind of looks buck tooth. Now, question here is can I make this into something good? They did say that rocks would just come out of the water. That was one of the messages. I think you need to see me play Tetris sometime. You will be, uh... I mean, I guess if you're looking for me to fail, you'll be... It'll be great. Got any of those mutants? I suspect they're all the same underneath. Uh, well, I'll give you the stale one, I suppose. Yum yum. Takes the aberrated fish from him. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Yes. This should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth, and I'll just take these two. They're of no use to me. Okay. Hmm, do you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please. So you need then leave. I must deal with this creature. Quickly now. I mean, I think everyone could have told you that was a terrible idea, friend. Fishmonger door snaps behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. Okay, barred from the inside. That's good. That's good. This was a good idea. This, we did good. Got a good feeling about these engines. They'll take you far away. Reliable, too, if I you care for them. Peculiar engine? <laughs> I mean, the rusty M4, it's fine, but I guess I would buy a second one, or a third one. And we do, like, this. Let's just, I'm putting it in storage for now, because I don't want to deal with that, but. We also have research parts, finally. Flexible fishing pole so we can do both coastal and shallow. Seems like a good idea. Engines. Improved outboard. Should have done that sooner. It's fine. Efficient crab. Okay, that's fine. Let's 
sleep is for the week. After all. That is how engines go, by the way. This weird Cine rod not do both? It was coastal and shallow, but the fishing speed was bad. Plus 6% rather than plus 50. The aberration bonus makes it so that I'll probably still want it. But only when I can get rid of either of these. If that makes sense. Uh, I guess I like don't need sleep, right? Is that that a fact? Cool. I do. I do feel more zoomy. Let's go get this relic taken care of, shall we? fishing right now. We'll deal with this later. Uh, okay. You enter the collector's house. He's standing at the back of the room, still holding a silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. Well, you have something, don't you? Show me. Hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head. Now somehow seem changed, smaller. Has it always been this way? Is that all? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems the pieces we're looking for have traveled further than anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision. You stagger back briefly. Otherworldly speed at a price. You have more relics to uncover. My intuition tells me the current may have carried some debris to the southeast towards the Gale Cliffs. Make that your priority. Mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Uh, yeah, I got a lot of them. Take a look at these trinkets. Oh. Don't bother me with common clutter. Okay. Where should I look? Gale Cliffs. Okay. Do you know who owned these relics? Yes. Who? He looks at you. For a moment, a look of something like regret flashes in his eyes. An old friend. Anything else? How long have you lived here? Quite some time. I used to be a fisherman, as was my father before, but two decades ago I took up residence here. I needed to focus on other endeavors. I found that this island has a certain strength to it. Those dark basalt columns stretching downwards into the deep. Uh, you cast a spell on me? holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one particularly wish to know more about? Haste. They're instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. Uh, okay. Nothing. I'll be going. Thanks for... Speed, but increases panic and engine heat. I just disabled my fishing pole like an idiot. for sure. A lot of places to dredge around here. That's good, because uh, I don't think... Okay. Because I don't think we're going to be doing a lot of fishing today. Oh, sure, I'll do another one. We can start working towards um, letting that lady move out of the crazy place. Ooh. 
lumber too. I didn't hear anything. Bolt of cloth. That is not lumber. That is a research part. I realize that I'm probably being stalked by like a kraken, but it's fine. Is that the dad who almost lost his kid's belt buckle? As far as I know, yes. Ooh, I don't like that. I'm sure that's that's normal. It's normal things that happen. don't want to say hi to that. Got it. We do not want to say hi to that boat. Spooky boat. Light housekeeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Oh, it's you. Who are you expecting? Your engine sounds like... I'm sorry. I mistook it for the vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back towards... We were given this boat, right? Yeah. Fishmonger, ugh, blind and headache today. Did you come by yesterday? I don't recall. Anyways, what can I do for you? Absolutely nothing right now. I uh, have to put a bunch of stuff in storage. Exhausted, you're not forgetting to get some sleep, are you? As I always say, taking frequent breaks is an important part of being productive. All oh, right, because it reduces panic. That's why you don't want to go. Is that chasing you? 100% it was, yes. Um, ba, 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 ba. I don't know, start working on anti-tangle line or something. My storage... T -t 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 -t. Boom. Don't need that right now. Everything else I need to sell. Ooh, three damage and I'm out, huh? Okay, good to know. Good to know. In like the worst way possible, it's good to know. Ah. 460, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna need to repair things instead. 200 is also too much. Okay. Um. Fair enough. We'll put this stuff away too for now. I'm guessing that did not help us. Not very much at least. I'm also guessing I missed out on the crabs. Got the atmosphere down pat. I'll say that. Trader, just get rid of it all. Thank you very much. And give the grieving father the belt buckle. This is this is his. Oh, thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please take this. Not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value to you. You'd be right. Anything else I can help you with? Nope. Arrivederci, friend. Mm -hmm. 
that is lumber. And if we get two pieces here, we'll be able to take this for the builder tomorrow, probably. We should probably start investing in our boat again. It's been a bit. We got sidetracked by a billion other things. This is the next island that's marked. I am so bad at directions. It's not even close to the next island. Well, whatever. We're heading out this way, too. I'm going to buy this game. Sigh. It looks fun. I, uh, you know, I regret nothing, so. I know he makes me buy games as well. He's truly a monster. Truly. Truly, I don't know how they let me get away with these things. No, nope, that's fine. What is this? You approach a hooded figure, swathed in dark blue robes, their faces barely visible. Fisher, please, help. You can barely hear the rasping whisper above the wind and waves. Fulfill the hunger. Hooded figure unfurls an old paper dog that is the most basic ass hunger you could possibly have I thought you were going to be asking for something gourmet and you're asking for a burger and like not a good burger either like a, like a White Castle burger apologies to those who like White Castle looks like there's other people who are just dead there which is it's, it's good it's good and delightful Um, okay. So this island had that, huh? Good to know. Hungry boys out here. Rotten masts inside. Ooh! Bag of doubloons! Ooh! And another bolt of cloth and another scrap. Oh, yeah. I said I was gonna go fishing and then I did exactly not that. <sighs> Though that could be blue mackerel. Let's say you. Hey. I only need one fish, thank you. To want uh, some hunger. Here you go. Boop. With expert precision, they plunge their hands through the gullet of the fish and tear out the heart. They stuff it into their mouth unceremoniously. More still empty. Tiger mackerel. Sorry, don't have that yet. Uh, it's time to book it. What's that? Oh, I don't I don't like it. I don't like the whispers, I'll tell you that much. We got whispers, we got ghost ship over there. I was really excited about the ghost ship, but uh, now I'm starting to feel like it would be a bad idea. Brood squid. Don't mind me, I'm just trying to make a little bit of money. Let's get out of here. Okay, crap pot. Excellent. Perfect packing. I have a full cargo. Thanks. Um, very good. Get rest. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. I know to get rest. Gosh darn it.
We could try to get nets here. We have enough. Kind of on accident. But I don't know if that'll actually let us buy nuts. Basic trawl nut available in stores. Okay. Uh, which stores? Right here. Operational for a day yields around eight today. Simple design passively catches basic fish when deployed. Wise investment for those that want to explore the oceans. That's me. Uh, except for the unfortunate part of I don't have stuff to do yet. So let's just take an actual snooze because we are panicked. Right, we're good. Hey, Neko Bean. What's a dredge? That's a great question. Uh, by all accounts, needs repair. That's fine. Probably should pick that up at the end. It's less a what and more of an action. In that we're just uh, deep sea fishermen. Trawling the depths. That's gotta be... Okay, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we got this. We got that. Got more research to do. No more books to read. That's fine. And, uh, oh, and try to avoid the absolute Lovecraftian nightmares that trawl the waters. It's fine. Everything's good. No panic here. Did a man eat a fish yesterday and go mad? Temporarily. But, hey, who hasn't? Am I right? for what I assume to be a bit of a wreck thing. We're hoping. How have you been, Neko Bean? It's good to see you. Strong wooden hole lays broken on the shoreline. Try to get inside the stern. I get everything except... except for that? All right. I'm being, I think I'm being messed with at this point. That looks relatively possible. No, probably just trinkets. You can still get some money out of that. I once again want to play Inkbound with someone, a streamer, a person from a gamer site, players in the game themselves, but no one's available. I don't even know what Inkbound is. But you have my condolences that no one's available for it. And I know my fair share of games. I don't know every game. But you know, I do my best to keep keep myself from becoming a gaming boomer. Symbol of your appreciation. Ooh, new book. Great. Sell that. Talk worker, you have anything to say? Do you, process, do you ever process shit that's for Blackstone Isle? Old ruin? Doubt it. Let's see. Looks through a large logbook. Appears to be a record of shipping manifests. Not so. Doesn't even have a shipping address. As far as I know, no one lives there. Okay, that's great. Any shipwrecks? If you on the eastern side, 
strange occurrences. Supposedly some 20 odd years ago, fishermen from these parts hauled up an old sealed casket. Oh, hell no. Pried it open, took what was inside for themselves. The very night, the fog rolled in for the first time and has cloaked the seas every night since. What was in that accursed casket, nobody knows. All the crew that lay eye on content went mad, or worse, expelled. The casket and crew have since disappeared without a trace, but the fog remains. Crazy stuff, huh? Stays pretty. Pays not great. Works straightforward. Yeah, that's fine. Nothing new there. Oh no, that's the wrong way. It's all good. It's all good. I mean, I know several games that rely on ink, but that I don't think it's the same thing. Maybe we go in. And then do a quick night fish out. Though this probably is going to take some time to like install. Fishmonger. That's fine. Do some research. We've got four more parts of all things. Huh? Okay. Refined outboard. Actually, the refined outboard might be the best because that's going to be like a, a tr perfect triangle of sorts. Improved trawl net and new fish. Yeah, perfect. Um, my storage. Oop, no. Bop, bop, bop. Thinking of selling that and getting a better crap. I mean, we got a lot of stuff to sell and not a lot of stuff to buy. Three hundred for coastal. I do want to start exploring the sea a bit, so that could help us. All that. That'll be coastal. And we can't. Maybe we put that in storage for now. Because that's our only way to get shallow. But we'll get a different one soon. I am totally right that that would help. Could also sell this. That wouldn't be enough, though, would it? No, I just think we gotta trust in the the net for now. And repair the crab. Which is different than prepare, return the slab. But it sounds the same in my noggin. Okay, relaxed mind, probably something. Ooh, so the net. Okay, the net just literally catches things as we go around, huh? Let's catch things you move, but you need repairing every so often. That's great. And fine. Suck the troll net ability. Yeah, dropped you there for now. things quick. Just need to find some lumber to do this quest. That looks pretty promising. Cool. Oh, 
that's actually enough stuff. I can just grab two. Oh, that's my bad. I thought we were done. Goblet. So it's kind of just tossing stuff here. Hell, we can do this and drop it off on the island and just keep our keep our stuff. Though we are, let's see. No, that's good still. I don't know why metal scrap's so much easier to find than lumber in a in a shipbuilding place, but uh, here we are. That is all I can fit, friend. I guess we have been dredging all day. That's cloth. I don't have time for that. I gotta get back home. Material pile. Easy peasy. I don't even need to make a second trip. Delivered all necessary materials, you should let the builder know. You got it. Oh, I can snooze at other places, though. I mean, the only thing is, you know, what's the fun in that when I can cause myself immense mental irreparable harm? You know, the real good stuff. The stuff that sends you past an insane asylum. Give me a new aberration, please. Snag squid. Ooh. It's gross. Tasting tongues writhe wildly around sets of yellowed, crooked teeth. Top row are flattened like human molars. Ooh. Great. Great, great, great. Good, good, good. Grab a crab on the way back. Cry because that is not how we're going to fit a crab. Your logic is really hurting my my rants, pirate. We've done it. No sense in wasting time. Let's get moving. Actually, why don't I just look up what Inkbound is so that I Inkbound Council game. Fluid turn-based roguelike. Oh wait a second! It's whoa 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 whoa. It's the new. It's the it's the new roguelike from Monster Train Creators. See, I don't know everything. Big dummy. Uh, that's gonna go on the wish list for future future me's considerations, if you don't mind me taking a second here. Monster Train was a pretty fun little card-based uh, Slay the Spire style uh, stuff. Da -da 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 -da. Let's get moving. Oh, uh, you can return the, to these items later. That's good. 
I didn't realize I needed to actually pick you up. Into the storage you go. That's it though, right? Yeah. Fishmonger. Encyclopedia could hunt for specific things. That looks uh, that looks sick, Nico. It really does. I didn't actually see it was internet, but we sold it. That's fine. Could get a better crab pot. Wouldn't hate it. You know, it's two to three per day. 150. Yeah, sure. Let's make that our next. Uh, let's make that our next purchase. And now I can put you on board, and we'll go back the next day. Good riddance to you, Greater Morrow. I am onward bound. We are gonna snooze then. I did. Uh, yeah, we are reading that. Cool. So many pursuits. I don't know if there's a story as much as just just quests and vibes, but I'm uh, I'm here for it. I kind of want to see plenty, 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 plenty. I kind of want to put that crab pot somewhere we'll visit on the rig. Just don't know where that'll be just yet. It could be this builder for all I know. Will do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome to come back anytime. Searches our toolbox, pulls out a handful of components. Take these. Thank you very much. Um, let's curl around this island completely to kind of knock it off our list. We also don't have any uh, cloth. We need that for future upgrades. So let's get some of that for ourselves. What did we get from that? Extra resilience to panic. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I don't need any more metal right now takes up a lot of my inventory, and that's about it. Just in the water, I don't... Oh, right, because we need, we need our shallows thing back, but we're using our net currently. Okay, not much there. Other than something stuck in my eye, but so we got the the hungry guy, hungry boy, um, definitely not shady. On the island out there-ish. That's about all I can think of right now. Get the trader. Sell my trinket. Thank you. Do the research here. good with that research. I'm good here. A hardy, two per day for five days. Aberration bonus. Large crab pot. And that's what we improved and already bought it. Is I thought we did? Am I crazy? No. Uh, that was the improved problem. Okay. Um... Well, let's get that done. We can't buy either of them, but, uh, you know, that's not a big deal, currently. I know we were directed... Oh, 
elsewhere, but I do kind of. Oh no, I can't hunt for aberrations. All right, when this crab pot's done, we'll sell it. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a couple days of boringness. Apologies. What's in our net? Found it. Cool. Got a crab pot. Got that. That's going in storage. That's going in storage. How's our storage looking? Doing pretty good. I'm gonna have to sell that at some point. Not that though. the upgrade for rod spaces 95 oh we definitely have enough for that right we have oh no we don't have two lumber that's depressing need more lumber but i guess that gives us a oh no god no <laughs> that gives us a um Reason. Cool. Let's go back to the builder. Because I thought there was definitely stuff out there. Uh, are you lumber? No, you're cloth. At least we have. Then that's a good purchase. Passive income is always good, or so I've been told. By a bunch of people that can afford to have passive income. Uh, thanks again for helping me move out here. I just get myself set up now. I found this while I was unpacking. You should take it. Another book, cool. Engineer's Companion. If you ever need to use the dock or store stuff here, be my guest. Anything new? Uh. Nope, that's fine. I it's a nice little, uh, it's a nice little base, honestly. To, uh, kind of stuff myself at if things have gone poorly. Cloth again, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yay! Oh, wait, there's an SOS thing here. That guy saw me yesterday and he's like, that fucking asshole. <laughs> I'm saved. Saved! Oh, you're a sight for sore eyes. What happened? I washed up here. Oh, it must have been two weeks ago. We were in rough seas and when a wave hit us broadside, I was jostled overboard and swept away. I thought my crew would come to find me by now, but yours is the first ship I've seen pass by here. The boys send you looking for me? No. I'm sure they're looking anyways. Can you give me a little marrow? Should be able to catch them there when I next stop by. Yeah, I can do that. Let me just store you sideways, <laughs> like cargo, and uh, grab some lumber while I'm at it. Need better fishing spots for to fit the shallows plus uh, fishing rod. Looks like it's been more than two weeks. Oh no, that's his natural style. And the smell is his natural musk. Don't embarrass him. Right, yeah. That's the issue. Short term problems for long term. The sweet, rank smell of civilization. Thought I could never miss it. Turns to you. For someone who's just been saved, he seems gloomy. Not got much on me, as you can imagine, and I have a feeling this isn't worth much anymore, for me at least. Perhaps it'll be worth something for you. Signet ring. Uh, thanks. A symbol is surely to bring good luck to any captain that holds it. I am gonna sell it immediately. <laughs> To do. <laughs> I regret nothing. Uh, 
I like checking in before the uh, night comes by to see if there's any aberrations ready and waiting to uh, to pop in. Does not seem like it, so we'll just uh, start a fishing. Brood skill, cool. And by cool, I mean yikes. I mean, sure, I'll grab you tomorrow. Okay, selling all of it. Dry dock for this. Yes. One. Back to no lumber again, though. There we go. Two rod spaces is great. This adds cargo spaces, though. Hmm. So we got... That's what it added? Okay, that's fine. How much do I still have? 321. We can go to the shipwright, repair the net. Then we sell the basic fishing pole. Don't need it. Go to storage, sell that, don't need it. And then buy the one that's for both, right? Wait, which one's both? One of these is both. One of them is... Oh, I didn't even need to do that! I'm, uh... I'm big dumb. All right, well, looks like we're going into oceanic fishing today. Let's see how that goes. Take that, pick it up. Oh god, is that gonna just stay there now? I'm gonna put the better crab pot here. I assume I can catch this now, yeah. Bronze whaler. Oh, it's so awkward. Still fits though. Fish and crab pot is there. Next question is where do we want to have we I feel like we've explored all of these. Gale Cliffs was what was marked next. Maybe. We'll see. We've hit on to that one before. That's where they, the hunger is. They're not marked in certain ways like you'd expect, though, which is kind of a bummer. Maybe try to hit these? It'd be a little risky. It's already 10.30. I mean, I could... Use my pan... Oh, they're... Cool. Hi! Definitely thought that was going to be way more horrifying than it was. Jokes on you. I think killer whales are heckin' awesome. Uh, 
What do we got over here? Nothing we can catch because I don't have anything that I can use. That's fine. Oceanic perch. Okay. Another one. Can I? Oh, I can. That I could make this work if I was smarter. I mean, honestly, maybe I can't. I'd have to, like, get rid of a motor. Ooh. Hello, Cho. How you doing? Honestly, right now I'm just pulling for a an aberrant. Nothing. Oh well. Oh, you can always see the lighthouse. That's super smart. Literally is like a beacon. Yeah, we're just fishing in, uh, you know, aberrant waters. It's fine. No weird mutations here at all. No, sir. Equipment types that use their ability will lose it 10% slower. Pretty slick. I love that we're just reading to become passively better at our job. See, this makes me want to, like, it just disappears. It's so creepy. Ghost ships. I think you would like this game. That's called Dredge. Just making our way in uh, a world that doesn't like uh, any of us. I'm gonna sell this too. We don't need it anymore. Okay, we can do oceanic stuff. We can do coastal. Can't do shallows right now. We can change that. We can change it. We just need to buy the flexible fishing pole, which is most of my money. That's fine. Okay, bought that. Repair it. We're good. Go here, go to the storage, replace that for now. It was good to get in ocean, but now we can do all of our basic fishing, which is good. I think next we want to look at getting this new hole. Um, need six... God, we need a lot, and I don't even know what the shiny thing is. Maybe we just go to, uh, like how the net has its own storage. Me too. That makes it a lot more useful and a lot less painful. I say we make our way to the next area. We've got enough uh, repairs going on that we can make it work. I think. We can get there a lot quicker than normal. Just need to either find 
uh, port when we're there. Or, you know. <laughs> Survive. I mean, there's definitely, like, places marked out that make me think this isn't just a lonely... Oh, well. That's on me. Yo! Big ol' humpback. Very cool. Don't worry about the red tinge. I'm just panicking as I, like, use eldritch powers to... Uh... Make my engines work better? <laughs> you know how it is. Okay, that's fine. Now we're on to this island complex. Oh my god! <laughs> That's good. <coughs> second time's the charm? No. Second time was not the charm. Second time, not the charm. Understood. Understood. Very sorry, sir. Very sorry. We'll be getting out of your hair momentarily. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enjoy your rest. <laughs> Mimics are now boats. Is this a mimic? A rotting chest. Nope. And thank goodness for that. And lumber. Which is great. We're gonna need it. Bad. Anything else around these little islands? I know it's about to get really spooky. It's fine. All is well. It did just take me ten minutes to to use a. Uh... I don't like the bubbles either. I can turn around, but it's fine. Oh, I just I gotta make sure everything is is good on this in this in this island. I don't want to miss any content. Oh, that's a new fish. Black sea bass. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm going here, and we're just we're hoping for the best. Is that just a big... Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. It's fine. No. No aberrant whispers, please. No, no, no. no. Thank you. No, I'm docking here. Sorry. Night, night. <laughs> oh, wait there. Your new face? A fisherman, I take it. Perfect. We should get along like a house on fire. I'm a traveler and a merchant all rolled into one. If you have any fish to sell, I'll take them on board and sell them the next town I come across. Likewise, I haul a small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to peruse the stock and see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. The Dusty Pontoon, huh? Right. Come by for a chat. What do you know about the Gale Cliffs? Well, there's Ingfell just across the bay, which is a dreary little whaling town. Folks there are always in need of something, which keeps me in business. Uh. Residents are always talking about the cliffs. Most seem afraid. Frankly, I'm not sure why they stay. Occasionally, I hear deep rumblings from within the rocks. I don't hang around here for long. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Da -da -da -da. Out on the water? Yeah, always. like to keep moving along. Merchanting is second to the traveling, really. I'm more of a merchanting traveler. 
Get to see a lot of places, which is nice. I also get to meet a lot of people, which is only sometimes nice. Strange things. Plenty, but I try not to dwell on them. I could go crazy, you know? <laughs> but hey, if you're seeing strange things, maybe you're not seeing them the right way. Maybe they're not so strange after all. Or perhaps they are, and they're incredibly dangerous. Better not risk it. Help. Assistance from an angler? Absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where each species of fish is located. Figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. Reckon you can share your info with me? Yeah. Fish I have left to track down are the oarfish, the gulper eel, the goliath tigerfish, and a colacanth. Uh, tell me about oarfish. Deep but calm water. Okay. Gulper eels. Deepest depths imaginable. Okay. Uh, we'll come back to that in 20 hours. Goliath hunt in murky swampy waters. I don't want to go to a swamp. And colacanths. No idea. They're primordial. Yeah, they are. They're ancient. They're living fossils. Uh, fish market. Buy any fish. Uh, yeah. Feel free. What's what's that one? Oceanic perch. Yeah, sure. Sell that. That's great. Have you met the photographer? Stop by my pontoon a little while back. She's loaded up with fancy camera equipment to take pictures of all the wildlife. Wish I had my own camera. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to document everything you do? You'd never forget anything. She was setting up on a small island to the south of the Maros. If you're in the area, maybe you should check on her. That's the second person that's directed me there. All these pursuits are... Like... Fun. But... South of the Mar... So she's somewhere here. Oh. That... Okay. That red must be the, the DLC, I assume. South of the Maros has got to be here, here. We'll explore these eventually. We've explored all of those. Yeah, that'll be fine. Moving dock. Same upgrades, but different place. Shipyard. I need to repair. Which has basically ruined everything there. Great. Well, snoozing time. She says she's a traveling merchant, but my guess is that is always going to be there. That's my guess, at least, because that's one of the three locations marked on the map, so to speak. There's two different towns, actually. Artifact of Manifest, huh? Show me. Vessel, grand prize, Mr. Michael Skult. Purchase from Antiquarian at Little Morrow for a bargain price. Previously salvaged from an undisclosed shipwreck. Has the letter J carved on the underside, otherwise in reasonable condition. Not been open for fear of damaging the mechanism. Wooden mask. Said to bring good luck, fertility, good health, fortune, rain, and protection. Traded for a pair of socks and a pocket watch chain. Bone china. Acquired from an eastern dealer. Do not use. Jar of earth containing meteor impact site. Allegedly. So there's 10 messages. So. Hmm. Let's uh, grab this. I did not understand what was going on there. Did I need to do the yellow one instead? Oh, okay. Yellow would be a trophy, I assume. That 
looks like a fake fish. Stone fish. Alright. One second. There we go. Turn around. Let's hit up a new town. See what's what. Mm, there's a retired whaler. Shipwrecks. The real wreck around here is the settlement at Gale Cliffs. My brother ditched us and moved on over to those cliffs years ago. I suspect he's regretting his decision now. Devil. Okay. Strange things. Just after the last whale was brought in, there was a sudden exodus from Gale Cliffs some time ago. Dozens of ships sailed past, packed up, hurrying away north as fast as they could. They were waving and shouting something at us from their boats, but we couldn't make it out. Never did see or hear of them since. What ink fell. Used to be a whaling town, emphasis on the used to be. We'd go out, bring in a carcass, and the rest of the town would get to work. But the whales got scarce some 20 years ago, and now look at us, barely scraping by for a new candle. Okay, depressing. What can you tell me about the cliffs? You look like you're supposed to be, don't mind Chelsea again, just our usual uh, mass pork chop murder. Definitely not person murder. That would be crazy. Many years ago, the cliffs used to be a haven for smugglers and pirates. Legend tells of two pirate lords used Gale Cliffs as their hideout. Supposedly, they got into some disagreement. Huge battles fought around the south side of the cliffs. There's a large number of wrecks in the area. Both sides were completely destroyed. Treasure horns left abandoned and unclaimed to this day. It'd be worth a lot if anyone knew where to find it. Okay. Odd characters? Magrin was an old whaler from these parts. As the whales got more scarce, the crew spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. Magrin, it seems, wasn't cut out for this. He formed an unnatural attachment to a scroll he found on one of the trips. He says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish. People started calling him Magrin the Fisherman. One day the town awoke to find all the boats, nets, and linesmen slashed in the night, and old Magrin was nowhere to be found. Hasn't been seen since. Okay. Can I sell my fish? You cannot. But right across the bay, you can. Okay. Do you need help with anything? I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner, but I'm having some issues. Around here, we consider aged conjure eels to be a particular delicacy. You might say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Normally, we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. Can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Can you bring... I can bring you an aged eel. I'll be decently compensated. Where do I catch one? And have holes and burrows in the cliffs. Okay. Light time. This way I have no one next door. Chelsea just dealt with them. Uh, it's why I have no critics, actually. <laughs> Hello. Can I? Oh, I am going in the wrong direction. Very cool and very nice. Just more uh, rockfish, I assume. That's fine. Oh, right. I didn't actually sell anything. That was very dumb of me. Oh, we got the tiger mackerel. I actually got to feed that to somebody. I can't have that be sold. Old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles to answer. Greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it that you need? Uh, what's happened to these cliffs? Well, they're being consumed from the core by that hateful serpent. Have you seen it? Nobody believed me, not until it started devouring our foundations, opening up chasms beneath our homes. It was nightmarish. Waking in the night to the sound of a creature slithering somewhere underneath. It seems to have turned its attention elsewhere, but not before it took everything from me. Great. Tell me more about that. A Michigan Sweeney town. Can confirm you should see how many coworkers that have left the company since you joined. Only the bad ones. Ha <laughs> ha.
You can see the gigantic holes it leaves just below the surface. As it forces its way out, it often causes rock falls. You plan on going in there, keep an ear out. So to catch sight of you, well, you should be able to outrun it. It's quite slow, provided you can navigate the passageways. How about shipwrecks? Someone that used to live here kept their ship moored at the base of the cliff till it was struck by some falling rocks and sunk to the bottom. They were devastated at the loss. We all were. It was a beautiful boat, decorated with all manner of memorabilia. In low tide, I can still see what's left of the masthead poking through the waves. Okay. Can we clear the debris? We need some explosives. Infell used to make explosives for the whaling operations, but when the whale's gone, I can't imagine he's still in business. Oh, but I can talk to him about it. Why do you live here? I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life. Till the collapse. Now I'm alone, cut off by land and sea. Left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move. It's not that simple. My brother would never... Ah, yes, you do... Your brother did tell me that, that he didn't like you. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here and took the family crest, I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? It's it's in the, the other houses, right? Crest went down to the wretched burrows. It's a lost cause. But if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. Yeah. Don't get your hopes up. I need explosives. For there not to be heckin' water spouts everywhere. Uh, Mr. Whaler used to make explosives? Yeah, sometimes the carcasses needed breaking up. Gross. Wasn't the most efficient or the most pleasant, but got the job done. Thinking about getting back into it. Might be able to rustle up something strong enough to clear those debris piles in the cliffs, but I'm not sure I don't have the energy these days. I'd have a use for him. Alright, I'll think on it some more, but I make no promises. Great. Cool. Super unhealthy. I thought that said Eichenfell for a second, even though I know that it didn't. Blackmouth Salmon. Cool. This is helping me fill out my encyclopedia very nicely. Very lazily, actually. Okay. Crab pots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I need that. Uh, oh, that's still going strong. I'm gonna put that in storage. Um, yeah, we're good. If I could. Do this? No, I don't have the don't have the chutzpah, so to speak. Um, next is gotta be. Have we done this island yet? No, we'll hit that on the way back to Blackstone. See something over there. That looks good. That looks like the thing we need to upgrade our hole, actually. Oh, it's a flag. Is there a photographer here? wreck with a familiar looking hole. It's almost identical to the ship given you by the mayor, except this one has a huge breach on its side. Let's uh, check out the cargo. A few items remain. Okay, yeah, let's I'll put that there for now. Oh, I don't need to install it. I'm just going to put it there. Okay, I'll just put it in storage then. Weak valve engine. 
18.9. Hmm. Tied up in the cabin. Uh, let's see. Loose floorboard. There are no floorboards left. Electrical equipment. A note. Cupboards and drawers. Methodically empty. Drawers are missing. Okay. This is why we check every single little island. I see lights out there. Mm. I really shouldn't. I should be getting back. Photographer? Photographer. Hello? Sorry, would you step out of the way for a moment? You're in my shot. A few seconds later, the photographer sighs in exasperation and mutters to herself. Something won't do. Angle the lenses all wrong. I'll never get a close up shot of anything with this, and the others, I fear, they were lost overboard. She sighs and looks off to the west. I was sailing from Cellar Basin, you see, squeezing my boat through a narrow gap between two islands, and I crashed into some coral. I thought I heard something in the water behind me, so I dared not stop. If you're able to retrieve the lenses for me, let me, uh, see. Rummages through what few belongings survived the trip. A spare camera here, I won't need. You're welcome to it if you can find those lenses. That'll be Mark. That's great, but I am gonna snooze here right now. Because this is too scary. Okay. Um, explore this island, then let's get back to uh, the Marrows, shall we? Let's do a little looky loo. Let's not talk about it, it's fine. So bad at this. Bearded mackerel. Wispy tendrils continue to writhe long after the fish had stopped flailing. Great. Thank you. Adios. So the question is, where was the... was it here? Or was it here? I think here was the hungry boy. Gotta get that boy hungry. Okay, I'm dumb. Again. I just get too excited about going fast. This would be uh, more trinkets. And they'll sell. Not for a lot, but you know, they'll sell. Okay, well, now I'm actually just, a, I think I'm just a moron. It's fine. I was definitely going to sell these anyways or something. It's fine. Yeah, 
still empty. I'm going to give you the grossest one I have, which is... Oh, wait, they're all fresh because they're still in the... Oh, that's neat. Cool. Well, I guess I'll give you this one. Again, they rip into the flesh of the fish, drawing out its heart. It's consumed as quickly as the first. Almost fulfilled. Snake mackerel. I just really like mackerels. Oh. I get it, buddy. My next purchase was gonna be, uh... Placement engine, but we'll see how this goes. Don't think I'm gonna have enough anymore. Oh, that's oceanic, I can't get that. Needs repair? That's okay. I'll take it all. Well, I was going to take it all. Um, except for one problem. I need... I think I need four spots. Total. Was I right? No. I threw away one extra like a fool. It's okay. No thanks. I swear these rocks are showing up different every day. What is it? Look, a touch trouble. Is the fog starting to get to you? Completely normal around here. Nothing to worry about. Good night's rest if you're right. Yeah, I know. Good night's rest. Uh, uh, sell it all. Yeah, cool. Thanks, uh, shipwright. Uh, I need to repair everything, which is going to be a lot of cash. Uh, that's okay, though. Ink Battle Mansion. 18.9 knots. It'd be a slightly smaller one, but not by a lot. I think I'd take that. Install it for now. And then this other one. We'll get a refined one later. Flag to give back, as well as pork chops. An unfortunate nickname for the pork chop. Yeah, it's like Porkins in Star Wars. Just meant to be painful. Deliver mm -hmm. a flag. Uh, yeah, let's attach it. You want a weird? Uh, Weird crab. I should take this. Um... Explore it all 
this. Let's do some more island exploring. We're in fairly good shape. We've got the crab pot with us. I'll probably drop the crab pot at our cliff location. Try to get new fish. Not doing that anymore because I'm a, I'm a moron. I should just never be given the haste uh, power. I'm treating it like the swift sail and wind waker, <laughs> and I really shouldn't be. Just turning it on and off as I please. Terrible habit. This is the first time I've been able to actually get lumber. Ouch. It's all good. All right, there was nothing left, and again, I proved to be a moron. Can't help but have his engines overheat. The worst part is I still don't know what we need for uh, the hull upgrade, which would give us a cargo upgrade. We're gonna pretend I saw that and I dodged it artfully, right? See, that one is like coming towards me. in front of Ooh. All's well. Maybe we just sleep for an entire day. swims are okay if sea fog shapes rest careful nightmares yeah yeah i know i'm sleeping no i'm gonna i'm literally gonna sleep all day or at least most of the day yeah you know what it doesn't look like my actual durability goes down so Sleep for sleep for the day. Yeah. Fishmonger. Oh wait, is all these rotten now? Oh no, because they're in the they're in the in the in the place. Mechanic shallow. Mangrove. 
improve. Yeah, I'm gonna buy this. I'm gonna install that. And then I'm gonna. I'm not allowed to get rid of this. Is that correct? Yeah, that's. I guess that's fair or whatever. Prepare that. Good there. Oh, I'd need a better. Oh, wait. No, we definitely can do that. 50 bucks. Space. What are we looking for? Refined metal. I have no idea where we'd get that, to be honest. That's fine. Do some more research. The versatile rod. Abyssal. Ooh. Twin prop. Jet drive. Mangrove shallow, volcanic or coastal. Should get an oceanic. Uh -huh. Let's put that as for sale, but I think that is it. Can't really buy a new thing yet. Oh right, we got a, a note. Deep sky, deep sky, deep sk forever, casket seal, broken, fog, core, five equals rise. He knows. Good good. Wait, that means there's an aberrant there. Yeah, free aberrant. The all seeing cod! Staring outwards, unblinking, eyes borrowed from a larger being, but not the mind to process what it sees. So we went there last time. We've got um, our goal here is this, I think, today. And then we'll see these other islands as well. We've touched all these. We need to explore through the cliffs, but. want to see also i'm wondering what the like touch the rocks are but only two that we found of those so far were uh in the morrows so i'm not too worried yet about losing track of them oh you gotta be joking me that was fine i'm actually miffed about that one Lenses. Photography equipment. Goblet. Cool. Okay. 
Um, gotta finish circling this. It is not lenient with its damage choices, I'll tell you that much. I guess we could go straight from here to the... Uh, always the engines. Yeah, the worst part of that one is it wasn't even like me burning it out it just shows the engines oh, firefly squid nice should probably get a better light huh Ooh, i see like red and blue over there it's like a neon party prefer if you did not do this. Curious looking chest, this hatch submerged in the sand. Look inside. Small scrap of paper. Uh, I prefer if you would not be there right now. Thanks. Appreciate it. I'm dredging here. Single doubloon. Okay, I think we're good. I mean, like, my sanity is very bad, but I think we're good. Okay, that leaves those three islands to hit as we go, we travel other words. Uh, okay. Uh, great. Very cool. Didn't realize we were playing... Subnautica there. Holy mackerel. Okay, so I guess if I go mad, I literally like draw the aberrations towards me is that what it is that must be because uh didn't like that uh what are we looking at then three of those got the two motors okay it was the day before Disaster. Two seventy-five. Man, you guys are absolutely ruthless on the price. Oh, <sighs> okay. Well, I mean, hey, that's a good place to end it. Unironically. We can ask about stuff here. Blackstone Isle falls under the jurisdiction of Little Morrow. Gale Cliffs. It's a whaling town, but I haven't heard much talk of it these days. Lots of people love. Yep. Stellar Basin is a popular tourist destination. There's a resort on the atoll built on top of a beautiful coral reef. Wide variety of fish there. Okay, that sounds great. That does not, that feels like the opposite of every single one of these. Hmm. Just a tangled mass of trees, blanketed in a thick fog. You want all good lights and a good sense of direction. Uh. 
and then the Devil's Spine is an active volcano amongst the city of ancient ruins. Don't go there. Great. Uh, all sounds delightful. Shipwrecks. Yeah, around the back, that makes sense. Strange Currences. Yeah, we know the mayor of Little Morrow went insane. And what happened to the last fisherman? Oh, he was very unreliable. Go out at night, come back with no fish, proceed to sleep all day. Terrible captain. Really terrible. Constantly running around on the reef, even in broad daylight. Shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. No good. One evening he left, never came back. So long, he shan't be missed by us. Great. Anything new from the lighthouse keeper? I try not to think about him. It's a painful memory for us all. Some nights I still think I can hear the hum of his engine sailing past the bay. But I know he's gone and I don't want to talk about it. Interesting. Well, we'll call it there. I got eaten by a weird blob demon fish after being scared by a demon shark. So, don't do fish, kids. It's dangerous. Which I've proven my point several times over. I knew fish were bad for me, so I hate them. But, we'll be back on Thursday with more dredge. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. If you like, leave a follow or just come back, hang out any other time you want. Other than that, have a great night. Thanks for watching, and until next time, do you.